Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Friday the 31st of January 2025. I hope you are keeping well. Uh, a couple of items of good news, although based on the back of bad things. Uh, I think uh, the fire aid event, I guess, is to drop some compensation um, for those people who have suffered from the uh, California fires. I guess that's what it's for. I'll guess that from the name, of course, it seems obvious. But the reason it's good news is Joni Mitchell is playing there, either now or has just finished or something like that. Uh, I just saw in the uh, when clicking on the LA Times uh, a photo of Joni Mitchell uh, playing a concert there, and anybody that has been on this channel for a while will know my cat is named after her, and I'm a huge Joni Mitchell fan. So hopefully, some video of that will break on the internet somewhere, and I'll be able to watch at least a little bit of that. Even more important, can you can you believe it? Even more important news than that: <coughs> people with sickle cell in the UK are going to be offered a treatment. And this treatment is described as a functional cure in almost all patients, nine, more than 96% of patients. Uh, I'm not sure the difference between a cure and a functional cure. I presume it means that if you continue to take the medicine, you won't um, be affected by it. I guess that's what it means. Uh, but this is this is a big this is big news. Uh, there were clinical trials earlier that were actually uh, not approved for, until uh, now. Um, I'm not sure what has happened. I'm presuming that the trials have proved uh, effective and um, uh, enough uh, evidence has been amassed. Uh, so the treatment is going to be offered on the NHS. Uh, so that's great news for sickle cell sufferers. Of course, uh, a disease that really affects the black community. Um, so that is good news, good news. All right, shall we get on with our game of Sudoku? Because I do have to go out and work today. And I've just finished washing my car and I'm pretty tired so I could do with a nap before I head on out. So let's play today's Los Angeles Times expert level puzzle. I'm going to start with the eights blocking down here like so, giving me an eight in that square. We've got fours blocking across here and there. Uh, we've got five blocking across here, up there and down there. That's jumping up at me. We have five blocking up here and five across there. So five in one of these two squares blocking across and a five going upwards, meaning that's a five. Fives to the bottom means that's a five there. To remember to move this cursor out of the way. Sometimes it obscures numbers. I, you know, I'm not paying attention to where the cursor is. Sometimes I do try to take it off the screen like this and click away quite often to try to uh, give better visions for some people who are blocked the screen. But I sometimes forget. One blocks both of these squares. So in this row there is a one. Uh, nine across here, across that way. There's another nine.
one up here, one down there, or one across there. Three and nine blocking across, all the way across here, so that puts three and nine into those squares there. Uh, how much does it help? I don't know, but it's going to put nines somewhere up there. And in that row it means nines in those squares. And what about the three? Uh, does it do much? Probably not. Right, so let's see what we're missing down here. So we've got three and nine in those squares. So we are left with two, six, seven here. Is that any good? No. No good to man or beast. 267 let's see what goes here then that's 26 or 7 so this has to be 4 and 6 hmm also not very useful so we've done a couple of things but it hasn't uh, proved to be useful just yet or maybe it has and I haven't noticed why yet so 4-6 uh, can we get anything else here 2 3 8 in huh wait a minute something is wrong I, m I made a mistake there sorry I, I misspoke I'm sure of it this is uh, not 2 and 6 this is Six is uh, needed over here. This is two and eight. Sorry, my apologies. That's got to be two and eight, hasn't it? Let me just double check that. This is three and nine. This is two, two, six, seven. Yes. So this is uh, four and eight. So eight blocking there. Of course it is because we've got eight and four here, right? So that's the eight and that's the four. Almost made a mess of it yet again, but managed to survive. We've got 8 and 9 blocking up there, 8 and 9 blocking up there. So we do have a pair of 8 and 9 in those squares there. <coughs> Shall I look down here? Uh, so we've got 8 and 9. We're looking for 2, 3, 6, 7. 6, 7, that's 2, 3. Hmm. Okay, we've got eight across here, <coughs> up and down there. Nine this way, this way, there's a nine. We know this is three, or as I remember the three and nine blocking across there. There we go. 
<clears throat> three across this way and three down there. So there goes another three, three blocking down here. There's a three. Six blocking this square here. So that's a six. And this is going to be a two. And we'll be left over here with three. Uh, I said earlier on this was something, didn't I? Eight and nine, wasn't it? Eight, nine, yes, eight, nine. So this is not eight or nine for this column. It's got to be a seven. And... Four blocks across here and up there. Six up here, six down there. One and seven block across here. That means those squares are one and seven. This has to be a two back here for something. Six, I guess. <coughs> six blocking up here, up there, and across there. There's a six. Six this way, this way, and up here there's a six. I'm kind of glad this has not been... I'm, I'm using the past tense because I think this game's not got any kind of logic problem left. So I'm, I'm kind of quite glad. I've I'm suddenly realised I'm feeling quite tired. Oh, sorry. Feeling quite tired and sluggish. Uh, hit the right key, please. Feeling quite tired and sluggish uh, at the moment. So I'm kind of glad that it wasn't a tough game. Um, it's just allowed me to relax a bit and I shall... I think I've got time for a nap before I go out. Uh, <coughs> what digits are finished? Six is finished. Um, let's hit the digits now and see if we spot anything else. Of course, I could be wrong. It might turn out to be a, st a tough problem at the end. I just don't think so. Uh, five and seven block this square. We need five and seven in those squares then for this column, and that's going to give me a one there. One across this way, back that way, and up there means that's a digit one. Could well be wrong. Oh, hang on. It looks like we are missing two seven in this block and this block. Is that right? 
uh, two and seven are missing in those places there so we do have a pair of two and seven in those squares now so what goes up here can't be two or seven must be three eight and nine three and eight are together so that's going to be a nine And this is 3, 8. And so these squares must be 2, 4, and 7. Just about 2, 7. Hmm. Seven blocking this square, so in this row there's our seven, and back here for a four. blocking up here there's our two uh, now I said before before two and seven this is a this two and seven in both of these squares right so when two and seven block across there and 2 and 7 block up there, that means that these two squares are 2 and 7. And this is 2 and 7, and so this can't be 2 or 7, it must be the other number, which is 4 for that column. 4 blocks across here, 4 blocks up there, and 4 blocks up there. There's our 4. The Okay, four and six are finished. Seven blocks that square there. There's a seven. This is a one. One blocking down here and across there. Finishes digit one. Okay, so 5 and 7 block down here. That puts 5 and 7 into those squares there. So now we know that can't be 7. That's our 7, and that's our 2. And back up for the 7 up there, and the 2 in that square there. 2 blocking down here, and there is our 2. And 7 is the last number to go there. <coughs> At the end here, we still need to place a 2. And we have 5 and 7 blocking down here. Those squares are 5 or 7. In fact, we get the 7 now in that square and the 5 in that square. And this will be a 3. Uh, 3 blocking up to the top and up here. There's a 3. 3 across there. There's a 3. This is 8, I remember. 8 blocking across there. There's an 8. Uh, last number to go there is a 9. 9 blocking across there. There's a 9. And finishing with 5. And that's it. And I'm just getting a message. Looks like I've got to get on with some work. Okay, thank you for joining me. I'll see you. Bye-bye.